All right, we are back, everybody, with more Stray. Excited to see what kind of adventures we continue on with this little kitty fella. You remember last episode, we were in this nice green area with all these nice little friends we had, and, uh, well, things happened, and we fell down to this, uh, well, dead city, I believe it was called, and now we're in, uh, I guess a flat, I don't know. But yeah, let's go ahead and see where this all takes us. Need help. What is this? Data corrupted, need help. Body required for download. We are the bo- wait, what? What is going on? I don't know, but I guess our kitty is a bit of a hacker. By typing eights. <laughs> Let's go see what that was about, shall we? You can see there's one of those things up there. There's also these, we can't do anything with. So we gotta get up there. I'm guessing? Oh, there's a, a lever. Okay, let's do that. Let me jump up here, we can grab a second one. Uh, also, there's a, re a remote. Second one's on. Another one's up there. We could probably jump up there pretty easily. Oh, there's one right here as well. Alright, let's figure out a way up there. Jump up here. Jump up there. Grab this. There's like a weird ringing noise. I don't like that. <laughs> it's pretty loud. I didn't uh, quite get it on there. And there we go. We've done it. Master of puzzles we are. Alright, onwards. This should be the human we need, right? Uh, why? Push it off. God, I can't get over it. The music in this game is always so great. Or, it's been so great the whole time. Like, it really kind of gets you immersed or whatever. Alright, I don't know what this is for, but I have it. Oh, nice, yeah, the, the, the monitors, that's right. There we go. It's really cool that they have that, because it would be a little difficult at times, I think. Got ourselves a little robo-buddy. Well, don't let him hit the ground. Oh my. Hey! Killed it. <laughs> Alright, well we got a little companion on our journey now, which is nice. We don't know how to speak its language yet. Oh, never mind. Cat in Dead City, I can't remember my name, it seems like my memory is corrupted, I've been trapped in this electronic network for so long. I work for a scientist who lived here, for now you can call me B12, that's what it says on my exterior. Dangerous in Dead City, but you seem like you know how to handle yourself, let's get out of here, follow me. Bet. Cool. Nikki yeah, unlocks the door, I remember that much. Cool. You get that. Thanks, man. Very good. Battery low already. Come over here. Oh, we gotta charge him up. You have to put this on. What is that? Oh, I don't want this. Wait, what's happening? I gonna lie, I bought a I bought a harness. Backpack was designed for small quadrupeds like you. It's uncomfortable. Yeah. Don't worry, you're used to it. Keys to store in the backpack. Okay. Easy. 
you're curious about an object, you can just show it to me. Or others you come across. Let's get out of this flat. Okay. Alright, well, let's get out of here then. Shall we? Ooh, wait, what is that? Long the scientist that worked here. For, yeah. Use the torchlight. Oh my god, that is bright. Okay, we definitely don't need that right now. Digicode. Um, shoot, we don't know the code, do we? Oh, we are gonna need the torchlight then. It is very bright though. Too bright. 3748. 30. 3748. And inwards we go. Dead city still dead as ever. I can't see. Where are you? The elevator in the distance is important, I think, but we need to go up. Haha, <laughs> look at us. Oh yeah. Now that's the way to travel. My gosh. Whoa, what is that? Oh, it's those freaking little vermin things. I don't know what they're called, but they are disgusting. Wait, I remember the outside. Oh yeah. Feels like I've been there before. Is this where you came from? Kind of, but not really. More green, less beach. I promised someone I would go there. I promised who? Blue scar from the mural was painted from it. Let's take it. What are these memories? How did they get there? Let's keep going. Nice, we got a memory. Um, can we jump that high? No, we can go this way though. Yeah, this game is sick. Let's head on down. Well, see, now the thing is, now that I know about these memories, it's like, I want to check every corner for memories. Safe zone. Okay. That's good to, that's good to hear. Oh, wait, we got like a little, an actual like safe zone. Asked all these things that are, tried to kill me earlier. Literally. Oh, there we go. It is safe, because as you can see, we've got traps. And now we're in the slums. Oh god. Yeah, run! I'll meow at him. What a wuss. Let's run. We can't sprint right now. Even though I'm trying. Wait, they're all so scared. They've never, they've never seen a life form. The fact that a cat fell down here. Did I get in? No. Yeah, this music is jamming, huh? Are we gonna- wait, are we, do we have like some combat here? No, Sha, right? Dude, I'm just a cat. Wait, no shot that this is part of the game. That we're just gonna like fight here, right? Yeah, okay. What does that mean? They seem to have their own language. You're no Zerk. We're not familiar with your kind. You're welcome in our village as long as you don't eat anyone. Okay. A zerk. So many questions.
All right, well. Talk with him, but we already did. Let's meet the people. Such a fright, we thought you were a Zerk. What is a Zerk? Show item. Oh, very pretty. <laughs> okay. Let's meet all the people here. Really thought you could take the elevator? I've never seen that thing work in 374 years old tomorrow. See, let's show you the postcard. What a shame, it's just a dream. It's not a dream, it's real. I go there, there's nothing there. I think the Momo just seen pictures like this. You show it to him. Momo, who's the Momo? Ooh. Please don't interrupt my meditations. Sorry, Johan. Which one's Momo? Maybe you're Momo. Ridiculous. They really don't know that the outside exists. You can try to talk to him if you want, but he gave up everything to leave. It's for the best. He's at the high level of that building and the orange neon sign. That's where we gotta go. We gotta go see Momo. The Guardian told us to talk to Momo up in the big building with the orange neon sign. He's the only lead we've got from getting out of here. Yes. We do need to get out of here. We had such a nice life before. This place sucks. I mean, the people seem nice, but... Uh... So wait, this was very progressive before, but now it's kind of like just like an open world kind of thing, almost. I'm looking for any sheet music to play the guitar. If you find any, bring them to me. I'm living near the elevator mosque. Okay. Maybe, maybe we can find some music for that fellow then. Those guys better not drop a paint bucket again, or else Cosmo will be ticked off. Oh, who would, who would drop a paint bucket? Surely I didn't do that about 15 times already. Beach, never heard of that in my whole life. Oh, sorry to hear that, man. They do have some green, though. As you can see, they have some forms of life with the trees here. Oh, let's meet him. I'd like to meet everybody. Take care of the plants. Improve, the humans have improved them so much. Now they require very little light. I just had a little bit of water. And look how big they get. It's really amazing technology. Beach, never heard of that in my whole life. Well... You guys really need to touch some grass, man. Now oh, let's talk to you. Musician, but I don't have any songs. Oh, you're the one. You write a song about that. Cool. Let's check up over here real quick. We found something. Memory. Remarkable, companions have evolved so much. In the early days, they were simple AI, merely Im imitated human art. Now this is all their own. Humans often said that making art is important to desperate situations. These are certainly desperate times. Cool. We found a memory. And we can go up even higher, actually. Don't bother Brother Vipora, she's so clumsy. Okay, well I won't even... Ooh. Dang it, I wanted to knock a paint bucket off. Ventilation power supply, huh? So what if I do this? That's probably not a good idea that we un unplug that, but... Oh, we get some water, thank god. Thirsty. Oh, nice. We can actually use it to do something this time, instead of just scratching our paws. Oh, we're back to where we just were. There's nowhere we can jump to, so we're just back to here. Okay. I feel like there should have been something we got in there, though, no? Let's go ahead and talk to this person real quick. I see. We're gonna make him drop the bucket. Something's gonna happen. Why do we do that? Why do we do that? Why do we do that? Oops. 
<laughs> You're damn right, oops. So what exactly did I do for us, though, to have paint down there? Is it just for funsies? Just a prank, bro? I don't know. But we're close to the orange building here, so... Just gotta figure out a way to get up there. This could be Momo, actually, right here. Nope. I want to see the real sky one day. You will. It's right here. Momo told me I'll get there one day. Yeah, you will. But let's continue onwards. Oh, big stretch. Big stretch. All right, let's keep going. Okay, we go up here. Make this jump. Then we're up here. Boom, we're in. What's up, Momo? Be excited to see me. That's for damn sure. Proof that the upper world exists. Can he not see us? Outsiders. It's never going to work. Why did I let them go? I'm all alone now. Hey, you, what do you want? Picture that side. Do you want to go there? Don't bother. It's a waste of time. It'll bring only loneliness and despair. Oh, despair. My friend had this dream too, but now they're gone and I'm all alone. I don't know how they ended up. I tried to contact them, but the transceiver doesn't work. My friends and I took our notes and research from outside. Here, take mine if you really want to go out there. Thanks, ma'am. You're on your own. I'm done with the outside. Good luck. We'll get you there someday, friend. Almost seems very sad. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, that's all them. Look at them. A happy bunch of goobers, that for sure. Let's translate that. City is about shape 450 meters in diameter. There's a level above ours. The city seems to have a ceiling. Yeah, I believe my books, the big blue sky is in beyond. Yeah, it does have a ceiling. We were there. And we will be we will be back there. 100 percent Wait, I have a hat. Get it off my head. Wait. Wait, I can't move. Everything is inverted. Yeah, get it off, please. <laughs> the controls were inverted because I had the paper bag in my head. It's like I was lost. Another memory. I remember this video game. It was just made after I was created. I can't remember. Is this another game that this company created? Probably is. Scientists and I spent a lot of time playing it. It was fun. I miss him. I can't remember his name. It was really fun. You should check it out. I think they have it on that Steam store that I've heard of once or twice in my life. Let's just imagine. Okay, well, that's a cool memory. Let's keep a move on, shall we? Hey, we got sheet music for the lady. Nice. Okay, well, I guess we're out of here. Broke the pots. Okay. I wonder if there's like an achievement for not breaking anything in the game. Because I think every player who plays this, they're probably their first instinct is to break everything. Knock over all the paint buckets. They see a pot that breaks, they go ahead and break it. At least that's how I play. Let's jump in here. Gramophone. I like to explore everything just in case. See, there we go. More sheet music. It is interesting in this game because we're so low to the ground. You're not used to that when you play a game. So you actually have to look up at things. So it looks like... Can we jump up somewhere? And I see there's like an area up there I think I can go to. Take Clementine's notebook. Same one Momo gave us. This one seems to belong to someone named Clementine. Everything is going according to plan. We managed to contact the upper level before the transceiver went down. They're also in a place called Midtown. Apparently it's controlled by some sort of oppressive force. I talked to Momo earlier. His eyes, I know this look. He will not come to us. Let's find the other notebooks. Okay. Nice. We got two out of four. Where to next? Mr. B12. Another memory. Is this the scientist? Looks like a poor guy wanted to go to the upper level. Yes, I remember. Midtown is up there. 
away from all the garbage and sickness of the slums. Even in dire times, humans cannot help but divide themselves by social class. Back then, a lot of people from the slums were prepared to do anything to move up there. Apparently, robots also copied his behavior. Hmm. Well, I'm not quite too sure where to go now. Oh, let's meet you. Remember, what is this? <laughs> Looks like some ram in, in a bucket of soup. Or a bucket of water. Did they really consume this? The original design didn't have that digestive system. Maybe somehow involved in... Oh. No, we should not try that. It's fucking pieces of ram in some sort of water. Oh, yeah, now we can go in here because of this, yeah. Yeah, we can go in here now because we knocked over the paint, which caused him to open his door. Okay, I don't know what they'll need that for, but figure it out. Anything else? Just that? That's all we needed from this place? Just some, some detergent? Okay, well, nice meeting you. Um, we're looking for the lady with the music. I'd like to give her her pieces here. Elliot programming. Knock on the door and wait for us to open. Okay. I mean, I tried to meet him, but I don't know what happened. Just over there. Okay, thank you. Elliot, my man! He's also got the symbols here. Let's go and remember this plant. This is a scientific marvel. It's remarkable that human uh, ingenuity found a way to create plants that thrive without sunlight. Organic life. Oh, robots don't need to take care of them anyway. Sorry, this music switch up really caught me off guard. It's <laughs> what the humans would have wanted. Alright, what's up, uh, Elliot? Can I help you? Alright, well, we've met pretty much everybody, I feel like. Can't leave this way. Well, we got a miracle, at least, and we have this. Momo, well, I'm back. Most fearless person I've ever known. We also have this one. What about this? I bet some people would pay a lot for a full bottle. Huh. So we're not supposed to be here. Only two to go. Oh. Alright, so we just have to... Okay. So... We have to look around in the abandoned flats and find the last two notebooks. However, I feel like today's been a, a pretty pretty impactful episode. Uh, and I don't want it to drag on too long. So I think we'll go ahead and call it for today. And we'll find the next the last two notebooks uh tomorrow. Yeah, thank you so much for watching guys and Yeah, thanks for joining me on this adventure. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.